Hi guys, welcome back to Lady Lee Kitchen and Decor. I'm here starting my my weight loss journey. As you can see, I've gained a couple pounds. So I'm starting my weight loss journey today. So come along with me and let us do this together. I'm gonna start from um, detox and cleansing. That's where I'm gonna start from with green juice. And I'm gonna show you how I prepare my green juice and stuff like that. There are things in there that you can use, but I cannot take them. So I will, as I go along, I will tell you what you could add in it for you to get faster benefits and um, stuff like that. So first I'm gonna start off with some warm water. I'm gonna start with some warm, warm water. I'm gonna put some baking soda some baking soda this is not my baking soda um container but this is what i can keep my baking soda in so i'm gonna put like one a spoon hat two spoonful of baking soda in my water and two spoonful of salt and this is how we're gonna do it. Um, first, I'm gonna put, first I'm gonna wash my apples. I'm gonna put my all my fruits in here. So I'm gonna also do this pineapple because I'm gonna use this pineapple tomorrow for another juice, juicing. So, I have a juicer that I brought, but I haven't set it up yet. So, I'm going to stick with my old-fashioned way, my blender. I am using green apple. The reason why I am using green apple is because it's a green juice. And green apple have less sugar than the rest of the apples. So, first of all, I am going to try to get my fruits clean and put them over here in so they don't get messed up in other things i'm going to clean up my let me show you how i clean my fruit so i said i add i add the um i add the salt and the the, the soda in hot water and i use a fruit brush that's what they call it and i try to clean my fruit as much as possible and then when i'm finished i rinse i'm gonna put them in there because sometimes you never know what's what's in your fruits what kind of bacteria it's carrying in and how they they um do the shipping and stuff so you have to make sure your fruit is washed thoroughly so this is how i prepare my fruits and vegetables I um, wash make sure I wash them properly um, and make sure they there is no pesticide or anything in there it's clean and nice and, that's it. and my next thing I'm gonna do is celery I'm using celery in there celery is good for blood pressure hydration inflammatory and all that good things and it has a lot of to give a lot of water in it so you don't need to use a lot of water in your juice um as i go along i will let you know how i prepare my what kind of place smells sweet you see as i go along i will let you know how i prepare my um stuff so i wash them one by one make sure they're clean make sure they're very clean 
You have to open them because you don't know what's inside of them. Sometimes you buy these things and you don't know what's inside of them. So you gotta make sure all of them is washed properly. And sometimes they have some dirt in here. Make sure you get all of that. Out. And okay. Then afterward, I'm gonna give them a nice rinse. So it takes off the sauce and the baking powder off it because you don't want your juice to taste salty i am not gonna peel my clothes i'm gonna um so this is how i prepare my fruits and veg and i am going to use some some parsley. Oops. And I'm gonna use some parsley also. I'm not gonna use the whole bunch of parsley. Parsley have a lot of um antioxidant in it. So let's that's it for a second and let me Dry my hands and look over here for something. I so guys, I end up touch the wrong thing and stop the video. Is I gonna use for something? I'm gonna be a professional in the video part yet. So I I touch the button and stop it. So let's continue where we left off. I'm rinsing my fruits and vegetable now so i'm gonna get down to business as we say and i'm gonna leave my time because these are going together and my brush my brush 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 wash my spoon my knife oh. i'm gonna rinse this off also so this is ready I'm gonna, I'm gonna go fix the, the, um, the juicer. Okay, you can't bother to put it up. Every time it's gonna go fix it, ne we never do it. So, so I'm gonna go in the old fashioned way and do it. I'm still gonna use my thing because I don't want anything. To spill so here is my clean bowl and I'm gonna use my juicing cloth um I got these off Amazon I think they were $12 I think about six of them come in there $12 yeah because some people would drink their juice straight 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 I don't do that I like I like sometimes I like when um when my um juice is clear clear but to get the better rough edge that's a good way to go about it so if you want the rough edge you can you can do that but me no I know rough edge right I know because this the tea, detox the stuff that I'm using is good enough and you can add um you can add um apple cider vinegar also some cayenne pepper also right, so now I'm going with me here I'm missing it. Going with my tail. Give it a minute. You have to cut the juice then. Got a less work. Next time. So that's my kale. I'm going to put this over there. And something fell on the floor. I'm gonna do my juicing on that side. 
So right now, um, I use this type of water. This type of water, you can use aloe vera water. I usually use aloe vera water, but I don't have any right now, so I'm gonna just that's a tip to get it moist and nice. You don't need a lot of water because the fruits they already have water in them, so you don't need a whole lot of water because you you really want to get. This this blender, you don't have to chop 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 up fine. You just go on. So the Ninja blender, then. I love them because you don't have to chop up chop up chop. You just cut to an extent and um, do it like that. So I'm gonna put my cover over, I'll cover it again, and get another quick one then. too much water in it because coconut water is also good because I use coconut water also but as we say no no coconut time now so I have to go with the flow 